Maxwell just walks down the wicket and goes wallop. Maxwell looks like he wants a piece of him and goes 25 rows back. Oh, that's right, okay. Oh, that's through. More runs for the Melbourne Stars. They're liking the slow stuff early. 24. Straight over and get off. Seems to be playing into Maxwell's hands at the moment. Gonna tug oh. that around. This is four more. This could be anything the way the Stars are going at the moment. Yep, right. Uh -oh. More to Maxwell. This is candy from kids at the moment. Oh. It's more for Maxwell. He's playing with the Hurricanes at the moment. Put that as four more in your book. Another massive over. <laughs> More of the same, though, from Clark. Just lent into the cover drive, races across the outfield. They'll get at least three. <laughs> and they've come back for a fourth. Brings up the 50. The size of the boundary. Oh, through the field. Everything going wrong for the Hurricanes. Four more straight through the legs of point. Sliced away. Four more for Maxwell. For a great sudden stand in. <laughs> Maxwell's toying with him at the moment. Swiping knows where the ball is going before it's bowled to. Admittedly, that was on leg stump. Well, that's a high ball. Men going back. Not going back that far, though. Toyota 6 from Clark. He moved to 30 from 15. Maxwell, I don't think there's any trouble coming out of it. Maxwell's causing trouble, though. That is another Toyota 6. Oh, he hasn't timed it quite so well. This could be the end of Clark. First wicket falls. Can gets the wicket. First off. Just keep bowling short on leg stump to Maxwell, and he hit him down there all day, every day. He might try. That pump straight down the ground. Four more for Maxwell. Well, that'll be four more for Maxwell. I think he's heard you, Gilly. He moves to 75 from 29. Crease. Lord Short, hang on! That's going to be six to the total! Still on, it's still on. Maxwell to 83! Still on. The <laughs> heist is back on. It could easily hit <laughs> three six. With a display at the MCG. Belts it away. It's going to be four more for Maxi. 87 of 35 in a night of pure entertainment. Around the corner again, this is the way he started his innings. 95 for Maxwell, one blow away. Crowd behind Glenn Maxwell, he's on 99. Works it around the corner. One of the great Big Bash hundreds from Glenn Maxwell. His second for the season of 41 deliveries. The second quickest of all time. And that man right there is a pure entertainer. Straight through Larkin, he falls. Well done to Thompson. Pretty good over that. Oh, oh look at that shot from Maxwell. <laughs> Reverse for six, if you don't mind. The times that we're in, unfortunately. Oh. Four more for Maxwell. This time he just carves it away over point. Tim David. Oh. Pumped down the ground by Stoinis. Six more. We'll let you go, Caleb. There's a bit happening out yeah, there. Thank you. Stoin just getting a taste for it now as well. Hasn't quite got as much. Yes, he has. Six more. Doesn't time it quite as well, but has got enough of it. Three sixes in the over for big Marcus Stoinis. Stoinis. Oh, he just pumps it down the ground. <laughs> that clear everything? Or was it? Seven from his last nine balls for Maxwell. That'll be four more for Maxwell, though. Moves to 126. Thanks to Kemmer's Warehouse, yet another boundary, two for 204. That's a shot. That is, that's a wonderful stroke. We've seen some creativity and power from Maxwell. And he's knocked down for a while as well with COVID. And that's uh, backed up with immense power. High score on the tournament, it's 147. He pumps it straight down the ground. He hits it hard. He hits it to the rope. 131. That'll be four more for Maxwell. He just keeps belting the Hurricanes left, right, and centre. Back with a square, there's gaps. Which is exactly where Maxwell goes to hit it. Four more. Valiant effort out there, but Max has gone four 
4-4 in the over. We go again. Oh, he's reversed it for four. This man is a freak. Equal higher score at the Big Bash for a team. Max is loving it. Out foxed. He's got to go. Got it fine, Maxwell. It runs down towards the rope. If it gets there, it's the equal highest score in their comp. It's the highest team score, and Max is equal to his mate Stoinis, who's out in the middle on 147. What are we seeing? Oh, oh hit a six over back at square. Take your pick. This is a massive, massive score. Well, they, they just seem to be playing as if they know exactly where the ball's going to be. But the 100 run partnership from 44. Stoinis oh. gets it high on the bat. Out towards a couple of fielders. Nothing going right for the Canes. Everything going right for the star. Stoinis, oh. that is hard, flat, and six more to finish the over. Stoinis is 67 from 28. Maxwell, 149, carves it away. 150 for Glenn Maxwell. A wonderful innings of power, timing, skill, and just talent from that man right there. This from the Melbourne Stars. Oh. Stoinis, that's the biggest shot of the evening so far. 25 back from M. Stoinis. Go on, have a smile, Marcus. Pumped down the ground from Maxwell. It'll be a single. Remarkable effort by the Melbourne Stars. Two for 273. Glenn Maxwell, 154 not out. One of the great T20 innings you will ever see. And his mate, Stoinis, 75 from 31. <laughs> what a pleasure to watch that. And it is going to need on every fire on every cylinder it has. Clark and Maxwell set the platform. Stoinis at the end with 75 from 31. But Glenn Maxwell, 154, 24 fours and four sixes. So much cricket coming your way. Have a look at the numbers there. Big numbers. Lamachani, world class, none for 52. Khan, two O's for 40. Big, big numbers. Ah. That is big over backward square. 25 rows back. Goes on the ground, but that. Oh, nice. Nice, nice. little nice. ramp shot Here's down. Your man couch. Yeah, down early. Nice little uh, flick over that region. Barmy Army clearly out. Oh. Hold him. That's the end of Jewel. Couch gets the wicket. We'll get back to the Army in a moment. Mm. Yep. Edge, straight defence to get things underway. Straight down the ground from McDermott. The first ball from Webster. So many black gloves. Hasn't timed it so well this time, but he's got it into enough of a gap. Well, he's hit the 60. Oh, he's yeah. poked that one. That'll clear everything. Exactly what you're talking about, Vaughan. Oh, no. Straight back. Okay. Second wicket falls. Thompson. Charges off the MCG. McConnell gets his man. Right. Hey, my one's on. McDermott gets the gap. <laughs> Powerful man. <laughs> one little stand out there where there's some sponsors have got a, a bit of corporate work going, a bit of hospitality. Which is a nice position to be in. Oh, yeah. High from Matty Wade. Hasn't quite got the legs, and that's the end of Wade. Hits him. Oh, it's there to be hit. That'll be four. Powerful hit down the ground. He moves to 48. Surely he's getting a point. Dermot on 49. Works it onto the onside. Takes off quickly. He's been a run machine. This summer has Ben McDermott. His third 50 and a couple of hundreds there. 51 from 29. He hasn't got out of second gear. No, he's, uh, he's played with great control. Down the ground by Darcy Short. That's well struck. And he'll get to the rope. And is that okay? Yeah. No. Oh. In there, isn't they? That's high from McDermott. Has a good go at it. There's a man out there. He tracks back. Takes the catch. That's the end. 
win any game of T20 cricket against any opposition. So they come up by short. Out. Anscombe hits that sweetly. Absolutely perfectly straight down the ground over the side screen. Those lads who've uh, got something about them. I think the Scorchers have got the most power and probably the, the deepest. Four to finish the over. I'm going to go with the least Perry. Yeah, and I reckon it'll be about. That's the end of Hanscom. Yep. Yeah, so pair of hands on the boundary. No, do I hey. Oy, that's a good hit. Should win better. Nice for David. Whipped away by Darcy Short. There's a big gap out there and he's found it. Four runs. Wow. I've already had him. Yeah. Had a 12 ball 50. Out. Another one. The V counts. Final ball of the season for the Melbourne Stars. Squirts away on the leg side. Massive win for the Melbourne Stars on the back of Glenn Maxwell. 106 run win to the team in green, but their season unfortunately is done. The Hurricanes, they were belted tonight. But they will play a final on Friday night against the Adelaide Strikers. Smashed the highest score of 232 prior with the Melbourne Stars 2 for 273. Stoinis, 75 from 31. The Hobart Hurricanes. In the end, they really took it as centre wicket practice to get ready for their final. See their top five make it. So no good for the Stars, the Heat or the Gates. Had a really tough season, only three wins.